Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to discuss the topic integration. So here we have the example for area. So first, sketch the graph of y equals to 4 minus x squared. And y is equal to negative 2x plus 5. Then, find the intersection point between the two graphs. After that, find the region bounded by the graph and the y-axis. So in here, my first step would be find the intersection point. So here we have the intersection point between the two graphs. So meaning that y is equal to 4 minus x squared. y is equal to negative 2x plus 5. So 4 minus x squared equals to negative 2x plus 5. Kindly rearrange the situation and we will have x squared minus 2x plus 1. If we factorize the situation and we will have x minus 1 bracket square which is equal to 0. So the value of x will be equal to 1. So here we have two equal roots. When the x is equal to 1, kindly substitute the situation into this part and we will obtain the value of y will be equal to 3. So the intersection point between the two graphs will be 1, 3. Next, we are going to sketch the graph y equals to 4 minus x squared. So first, rearrange the situation. So y will be equal to negative x squared plus 4. So first, the shape is a n shape because a is less than 0. Number 2, we have the x-intercept, meaning that when y is equal to 0. If y equals to 0, so 0 will be equal to 4 minus x squared. If we simplify the situation, we will have 2 minus x multiplied with 2 plus x. So meaning that, x will be equal to 2, x will be equal to negative 2. And the point will be 2, 0, negative 2, 0. For the y-intercept, when x is equal to 0, y will be equal to 4. So the coordinate will be 0, 4. Next, we are going to sketch the graph for y is equal to negative 2x plus 5. So meaning that when x is equal to 0, the value of y will be equal to 5. So here we have the coordinate 0 and 5. Next, when y is equal to 0, the value of x will be equal to 5 over 2. Meaning that we have the x-intercept as 5 over 2, 0. So next, we are going to sketch the graph. So where we will have the n-shaped graph. So kindly locate the point in the graph where we have 1, 2. 1 and 2. So here will be the negative 2 and here will be 2. Next, we have 0, 4. So 1, 2, 3 and 4. So that would be the graph y is equal to 4 minus x squared. So where we have the value 4. Next, we have to sketch the graph for the straight line. So the location would be 0, 5. So here will be 5. Then, as we all know, we have the intersection point at 1, 3. So the location will be around here. So the coordinate for this part will be 5 over 2. So here will be the shaded region. Find the region bounded by the graph and the y-axis. Integrate the situation. We are using the negative 
2x plus 5 minus the curve where the curve will be 4 minus x square with respect to x and the region would be 0 until 1 so meaning that from 0 until 1 would be the limits so now we have to expand the situation where we will have integrate negative 2x plus 5 minus 4 plus x square with respect to x rearrange the situation so x square minus 2x plus 1 with respect to x so we have to integrate the situation from 0 until 1 next by using the direct method we integrate the situation so x to the power of 3 over 3 minus x square plus x for the limit 1 and 0 so if we substitute the situation and we will have 1 over 3 minus 1 plus 1 bracket minus if we substitute 0 we will obtain 0 so finally the area would be 1 over 3 unit square next we are going to find the area with respect to y so meaning that if we are looking for y the value will be from the 3 to 4 next we have 4 until 5 so kindly observe the situation so now we are going to find the area with respect to y so meaning that we have to express the situation x as a subject so kindly focus on the straight line change the subject so that x become the subject so in here we have 2x is equals to 5 minus y and x will be equals to 5 minus y over 2 same goes to the quadratic so we will have x square is equals to 4 minus y so 4 minus y we have a square root so now we are going to find the area with respect to y so kindly observe the situation we have the path from 3 until 4 it involves two graph and then for 4 until 5 it only involves the straight line so integrate from 3 to 4 so we are going to use the straight line where we have 5 minus y over 2 minus the curve meaning that 4 minus y to the power of 1 over 2 with respect to y plus with the second region integrate from 4 to 5 it only involves the straight line so meaning that 5 minus y over 2 with respect to y so now we are going to integrate the situation where we have 5 minus y bracket square over 4 do remember to differentiate the internal function and we will have negative 1 minus 4 minus y to the power of 3 over 2 over 3 over 2 do remember to differentiate the internal function and we will have negative 1 and where we have the limit 4 3 plus we will have 5 minus y bracket square over negative 4 for the limit 5 and 4 if we substitute the value 4 and we will have 1 over negative 4 minus if we substitute the value 4 and we'll obtain 0 minus if we substitute the value 3 and we will obtain 2 to the power of 2 4 over negative 4 minus if we substitute the value 3 and we will obtain 1 over negative 3 over 2 simplify the situation negative 1 over 4 minus bracket negative 1 plus 2 over 3 then we will have negative 1 over 4 
minus bracket negative 1 over 3. So finally, we will have 1 over 12. Next, focus on the right hand side. If we substitute 5, we will obtain 0 minus. If we substitute 4, and we will obtain 1 over negative 4. So simplify the situation and we will have plus 1 over 4. Then, if we add on the situation and we will obtain 1 over 3 unit square for the area. And we notice that the area will be the same if we are looking for respect to x or respect to y. So here we are and thanks for watching.